Fortin. It's time to close the show with a trick by Penn and Teller. What's in the Times today, Teller? Oh, man, all that election stuff. Trying to pick one of these guys. Like trying to pick your favorite Kardashian, isn't it? It's kind of hard job. Oh, here's the, I, I love reading about animals. You know, the oldest gorilla in the world, Raji, just celebrated her 59th birthday. She celebrated by eating fruitcake, growling, and showing her backside. Same way Bette Midler celebrates her birthday. <laughs> Oh, and business news, you see this? Smuckers, the jam company, they have merged with Folgers. And they're either going to call it Smolgers or, uh, or they're going to call it Smolgers. They've already, they've already decided here. I always read the fashion news. I love reading about fashion. This designer came up with a new dress, has a big picture of Obama on it. You know, putting something presidential on a dress, wasn't that Bill Clinton's idea? I think it was, yeah. That yeah, was his idea. What? Oh, Starbucks has a new drink coming out. It's sugar-free, fat-free, and has no whipped cream. It's called coffee. I'll try that for a change. Did you see the big, long interview with Prince Charles? Prince Charles has come out against genetically modified food. Well, if anyone knows about the dangers of selective breeding, it's Prince Charles, huh? Let's read the whole interview. It's on page 11. Yeah, there it is right there. It starts right there. And it continues on all the other pages. That's where it is.